Zhu Yan is the first boss you'll encounter during the second chapter of Wo Long Fallen Dynasty, and even though he is not as strong as Feng Shi, the last boss of the chapter, he might give you some trouble as you don't have your Divine Beast available yet. The fight itself is not that hard once you learn his moveset and almost feels like a tutorial boss because of its predictable attack and by how forgiving his critical blows are. Most of his regular attacks are slow and anticipatable. He also has two critical blow attacks. The first one is a fast forward slash that doesn't deal that much damage and is really easy to deflect. The second one is slower but deals more damage and is harder to deflect. I think that Team Ninja did a really good job by placing the boss here and making sure you've learned all you need to know before continuing on further in the game. Once you've defeated him, you'll be rewarded with your first Divine Beast. Its main skill allows you to summon Pillar Stones, while the Divine Resonation provides you with a boost that reduces the HP damage taken and increases your Spirit Gauge recovery. 